Hello, and welcome to this Web Focus Key Feature video. This video will introduce Insight, a feature that allows you to make significant modifications to your content at runtime that can be enabled with the click of a button. InfoAssist provides a few options to enable runtime modifications. You can turn on InfoMini to provide a selection of ribbon functionalities, such as slicers or output format changes. You can set the output format to active report to enable a number of runtime capabilities such as sorting, aggregating, or using the rollup tool to create a new chart using existing fields. Or you can create a visualization, which provides numerous filtering options at runtime. Insight, however, is unique in allowing you to completely transform a chart at runtime. Enabling Insight just takes a single click of a button. Once you've created a chart, just click Insight in the Run With group on the Format tab. Insight works with any chart with a default HTML5 format. When you run a chart with Insight, the Insight toolbar appears above the chart output. It shows the fields in use in the chart. You can also launch Insight with no fields selected in InfoAssist, allowing you to build your chart from scratch right in Insight. You can click a single-headed arrow next to a field name to sort that field differently, or click a field name to change the field in the chart. Insight allows you to choose between any field in the data source, even those not already in the chart. Insight provides a search box when you select a field, which is useful for large data sources like this one. When you make a modification, the chart reloads. You can also filter the chart using any field in your data source. Click the Filter button, and then click the Filter icon on the filter bar. You can pick any field to create a filter for. You can then select values from the field to complete your filter. The chart reloads to apply it. You can even use Insight to change the structure of your chart. You can add another measure or sort field by using the plus sign buttons to the right of a field. You can also switch the axes of the chart, or even change the chart type. When you change the chart type, Insight adapts to the field containers that each one uses. So if you change from a bar chart to a pie chart, you will go from having a horizontal axis, group, and color field, to having matrix row and column, measure, color, size, and tooltip field containers. If you like your new chart, you can save the version that you created in Insight to access later from your WebFocus repository. You can save a variety of charts modified in Insight for cross-comparison. Additionally, you can click the three dots at the right of the toolbar to export an image of the chart. You can also export data, set the y-axis to a logarithmic scale, show data labels, and change the series layout for certain chart types. For example, from a stacked bar chart to a side-by-side -side bar chart. Finally, if you want to return to the original chart, click the Reset button on the toolbar. As you can see, the Insight feature allows you to explore your data in countless ways even without opening InfoAssist. To learn more, visit the WebFocus 8205 Knowledge Base, where you can search all technical topics and videos.